Hey guys, I'm Sapphire and you're watching Toon Buds on Channel Frederator. Today we're going on a highway to the danger zone. Archer is the hilarious animated series on FX about the spy agency ISIS and the lives of its employees. H. John Benjamin plays Sterling Archer, the world's greatest spy, but possibly the worst human being ever. Despite their abilities to save the world from global crises, the employees are just a bunch of backstabbing, sabotaging egomaniacs all up for themselves. Archer's voice cast is full of comedic geniuses, Aisha Tyler, Chris Parnell, and Jessica Walter, just to name a few. After the Archer panel at Comic-Con, I was able to catch a few words with Adam Reed and Matt Thompson, the executive producers of the show. They've been working together for more than 18 years. Their first project was High Noon Tunes on Cartoon Network back in the mid-90s. They then went on to create the Adult Swim shows Sea Lab 2021 and one of my all-time personal favorites, Frisky Dingo. I'm here with Adam Reed and Matt Thompson, who are the executive producers of Archer. We're gonna just do a little chat with you guys. So what was the inspiration for Archer? We, had, uh, we did a show called Sea Lab 2021 which was sort of a, uh, I don't think underwater laboratory is a genre, but we sort of uh, took a serious show and, and, and messed around with it. And then our next show, Frisky Dingo, was uh, superhero versus supervillain, and we tried to crack open that and, and skew it and make it a really weird take on that. And so now that's what we try to do with Archer. Uh, spy fiction is so well established, but we tried to do something a little different with it. Do you guys think there will ever be another Frisky Dingo season? No, no, no. Like, the one thing that I love about that is that um, I go back I go back and uh, watch uh, episodes of Sea Lab and it's really bad. Like some of them, some of them are good. It's like reading your high school diary. <laughs> where you're like, I can't believe I wrote that. I was such a, such a turd. Um, but then I go back and watch Frisky Dingo. I go back and watch Frisky Dingo and I... I, I like Frisky Dingo. I, I, I miss Frisky those Dingo. characters, and I would love to uh, to do it. But uh, I don't. We, we don't own it. We don't own it. We didn't negotiate that deal, maybe as uh, as well as we should have. So we would love to do it, but we don't own it. Yeah, they just gave us like some bricks, magic beans, magic beans, magic beans. Here's a TV show. Do you guys have any advice for aspiring writers or animators? You know, YouTube. Yeah. Uh, we have an animator who wrote, voiced, and animated on his own uh, a short that he put on YouTube. And what did it get up? Seven million? Yeah, it, was about, it was about seven million. It was a short for uh, the boy band uh, One, Direction. One, One Direction. And it was just like a One Direction fanfic, 20 minute thing. It was funny, it was good, it but blew he did it himself. Up. And he got a call from, you know, like agents. Almost, almost every <clears throat> animated network gave him a call. And he no longer works for us. He yep. is an executive producer on something else. So I think make stuff and put it on YouTube. And if it's good, somebody's going to find yeah. it. Because uh, there are, you know, people at networks who their whole job is to scour YouTube yeah. for good stuff. Everybody's always so worried that, um, oh, I don't want to put it on YouTube because then somebody will steal my idea. It's really not about that. It's, it's just getting people to know who you are. You're, there's always other ideas. Oh yes, can you please say something as Ray? No. <laughs> okay. No, that was as Ray. That was as Ray. <laughs> um, my the Ray voice is actually very similar to my real voice. What? He's just a little more country, a little more high pitched, but it's a uh, it's actually very very close to my real voice. But y'all are the best. I think y'all are the best. <laughs> Adam and Matt are two evil geniuses. I'm hoping some of that transferred to me just by standing next to them. Who's your favorite character in Archer? Tell us in the comments. My favorite character in Archer is definitely Cyril Figgis, who is the ISIS comptroller, recently turned uh, field agent. He's voiced by Chris Parnell, who is seriously one of my favorite actors of all time. Like anything he says is funny. He could tell me like some sad sob story about his childhood, and I will laugh. 